more Eurovision news coming your way. So, France Televisions announced earlier today that 30-year-old singer, actor, and comedian Tom Leap will represent France at Eurovision 2020 in Rotterdam, the Netherlands. After a somewhat controversial doing away with the destination Eurovision national selection, the French public broadcaster opted to internally select Lieb and the delegation from France Televisions France 2 solicited around 100 songs from European record labels to pair with him. The song will be released at a later date. Now you may be wondering, who is this young gentleman representing one of the biggest countries in Eurovision? Well, let's find out. Born March 21st, 1989 in Paris, Leib followed in his family's footsteps by becoming an actor. Additionally, being the son of famed French comedian Michel Leib, he also decided to branch out into comedy with a highly viewed YouTube channel featuring skits and songs with fellow comedian Kevin Levi. Leib also starred in a 2014 theater production of Miss Doubtfire with his father. He studied acting in New York City and since returning to France has amassed 20 acting credits. Highlights include the 2017 remake Papillon starring Charlie Hunnam and Academy Award winner Rami Malek and a sizable role in the Jean Reno starring comedy drama Avis de Mistral. Eventually, Lieb branched out into music as well, having a hit single in 2018 with Are We Too Late? Go ahead and fly Cause everything I see already He released his debut album, Recollection, towards the end of 2019, so very recently. This is what Lieb had to say about his participation. The Eurovision Song Contest is an iconic and unifying event. I am so proud to be representing France and I can't wait to live this experience with you all. Though France has won Eurovision five times, their last victory came in 1977. So more than 40 years ago, 43 to be exact. Comme l'oiseau bleu survolant la terre, voit comme le monde, le monde est beau. Last year, Bilal Hassani, who won Destination Eurovision, finished 16th at Eurovision 2019 in Tel Aviv, Israel. And Lee will be looking to improve on France's relatively mediocre showing at Eurovision this last decade, with Amir's sixth place at Eurovision 2016 being the best finish. The question is, what do you think of France's choice to represent them at Eurovision 2020? Or are you still disappointed Destination Eurovision went away? At least for now. Let us know in the comments below, on social media, or of course on our forum. I'll talk to you all later.